He has supreme confidence facing a very good defense. And Ehlers will throw on first down for Tyler Sneed. He's the quick game guy. And can run with, uh, with that size. Quick set again. Ehlers on target across the 30-yard line. 87%. You're winning 87% of the games that you're playing in. Boy, that takes a tremendous amount of focus. Motion before the snap, and he's got a quick hitter. The other skill position players around him, and he just looks so much better this year. He'll try to throw. He lost the ball on the way through. On first down, a loss of three on the fumble. And Ritter... On a third down and four, will run for it, and he's got the first down, Desmond Ritter. Throughout the depth chart, that too deep, when you go through it, there's a lot of experience on this Cincinnati team. On the jet sweep, Trey Tucker turns it upfield, and Tucker's got himself a first down. Opening possession for Cincinnati in the ball game. The tight end Wiley in motion. To around 50 55 percent third down and six for Ritter he's got a crossing pattern for a first down to Jordan Jones the Arkansas transfer so a bunch of receivers targeted on this opening drive For the last two years certainly he was the American Conference rookie of the year but he's more of a complete package now as he's got the tight end Wiley who staggers across the 35 lost the football and the question is was he down and giving him the football, and they've gone right down the field. Tenth play of the drive right here off play action for Ritter. Des Ritter wants himself a touchdown and got a walk-in score. Third and 11. They only rush three. Ritter decides to run. The spies were off duty. First down, Cincinnati. And they were waiting on Ritter. They drop way out of the picture. And they just leave a bunch of green turf. Their first convenience store picture of Friday Night Football this year. Maybe not the last. Ehlers to throw, wanting the sideline into traffic, and Wiggins ripped it off. Tackles, a sack, forced fumble, five pass breakups, and this is a guy they missed last year. Two passing touchdowns allowed by this defense that has been just a stone wall all year long as Dokes gets him across midfield with four and a half to go in the first half. Ritter's second down. Off the quick set to Young and a first down for Michael Young Jr. There's Ritter. Far side, Young again turns it upfield. And the Louisiana native has a first down again. Hopefully that same thing doesn't happen here tomorrow. <laughs> you hate to say uh, that you hate to see, but you really do hate to see the, the uh, red-headed 13-year-old tears of Rocky Boyman. I mean, that what a sad picture that is. <laughs> Dopes on the run, and it's first and goal for the Bearcats. On the line playing offensive line for Cincinnati is Wiley's in motion. Ritter rolls with the ball. Wiley becomes a blocker and Ritter pirouettes in. Kind of glider when he runs. Everybody goes crashing down inside and he's able to leverage the defense. And this is just will and want to. See where we are as we, you know, as the deeper we get into the second second half. A run it with Harris. I thought you learned at quarterback school. Everybody's supposed to say, "Oh, it's my fault. I'm the quarterback. I'm the leader." Uh, Point at me. Not when it comes to that. Eight straight completions for Des Ritter. Going for nine. Ritter has to eat it there, and he's sacked by Rick Diabreu. It's a first down carry, and they'll go with Keaton Mitchell, who had the lone touchdown in the first half. 
goal in the playoffs to the house for the Ravens against the Titans back in the year 2000. Free runner coming. And Ehlers goes down, sacked by Ethan Tucky. Been close on a couple of occasions tonight. They blitz him, and he's able to get home. Got a lot of weapons, and this is the point, is the trust of Desmond Ritter for the rest of his teammates as this one is incomplete. He will run on first down and it is Harris plunging forward right near the line to gain a down at the bottom of their conference all the way to the top James Madison obviously with that great run to the FCS championship as they get there it's Malik Van with the sack this is just bull rush and taking a guy and putting him on his fanny you know, I think that maybe plays in their favor especially a conference like the Big Ten that's an interesting thought, certainly, as Ritter has to bail out of the pocket, and he gets a nice block over on the outside from Dokes, and Ritter is off and running. He had a 91-yard rushing touchdown earlier this year, and this one goes for 27 and a first down. That forces you to play 11-on-11, 11 11, and he hits a gear at the end of this run. He has a sense for where the first down marker is. Ritter down the middle, got a touchdown. Jay Sean Jackson. Last season, and they've given up only 10 to this point as Holton Aylers sets up a second down and three, and they will run on that second down. And Keaton Mitchell with that first one more time for a first down ECU. I'll tell you that story after this play. Ooh, a tease, second and eight. Ehlers is hit and he goes down. It's a sack for Van Fossen. All right. And they certainly get after the passer and they can play man to man coverage, which allows them to do a lot of stuff on defense. They brought five and got a pick. Colby Bryant goes high for it. A fourth down interception for Bryant down the sideline. Think they were mad about giving up 43 last year. That could be a sneaky good game, Miami, uh, Miami, Virginia Tech, beginning of the day tomorrow. And they're going to go ahead and fake it. Cincinnati has a first down off a fake punt up 42 to 10. Sign of some, some sort, because you're up that much or you're putting UCF on notice for something to work on next week. And, uh, and a mentor in my life as well. Just a great, great champion and leader of young men out there. It's a run for Ford on first down, and he gets to the outside for a Cincinnati first down. Same coach as when you were there, still rock. In case you need them, and especially in a COVID climate, you might need some of them. Ford wrestles his way in for a touchdown for Cincinnati. You know, Wi-Fi and all that kind of stuff, I'll be able to tune in and put a pair of AirPods in and listen to all the action. That's what ESPN Plus is for. Garcia down to the one yard line so a first and goal for ECU at his uh of his choosing saw Marcus Freeman on the sideline his defense does give up a touchdown and now a little post play discussion and some hand fighting going on the Emmy for telestration goes to our producer Ben Cerny on that 100 percent they're going to run one more time and get a big hit out of it Cincinnati, one more for the road. Touchdown, Bearcats. Oh, my goodness. They broke off one more just for fun. And Cincinnati's Cameron Young, the senior out of Columbus, breaks free. It won't be the first time when they hit the field. One more final play on a run for Harris. And ECU fumbles the football. Cincinnati's got it. And the play's been blown dead. What a wild final couple of minutes in this game. Big punt Man, up big for Cincinnati. The flags were for flags dead ball everywhere. Fouls. That is the end of the game. Well, partner, Rocky, this has been quite the game.
Andre. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.